I am a girl with Asperger's syndrome. I'm the Aspie girl. Hi guys, it's Alexa. Welcome to my channel. Are there ever times where you're making chocolate chip cookies and you just want to eat the dough? I definitely have those times. When making chocolate chip cookies, I definitely have to have at least one bite of the unbaked dough, regardless of the raw eggs and flour in it. Well, in this video, I'll be showing you how to make cookie dough that's not only safe to eat, but it's actually healthy compared to normal cookie dough. Let's get into the recipe. For this edible cookie dough, you'll need a food processor, chickpeas, vanilla extract, a sweetener of your choice, I'm using honey, nut butter, I'm using peanut butter, and chocolate chips if you'd like. First, strain your chickpeas in a strainer or colander to get rid of the liquid part. Once you've done that, put your chickpeas in the food processor along with some vanilla extract sweetener and nut butter, and then blend it until it's a paste, like this. It should have the consistency of cookie dough. Next, stir in your chocolate chips, and then enjoy. Now, I know the thought of chickpeas in cookie dough is not only weird, but gross, but once you blend it with all of those sweet things, you'll forget that there's even chickpeas in it. It's actually really good. It tastes exactly like cookie dough. The cookie dough you love to eat when making cookies. You can bake this dough and it'll taste like cookies, but not the cookies you're used to. This is meant to be eaten raw, and since there's no raw eggs or flour in it, it's completely safe to eat and delicious. That's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed learning how to make healthy edible cookie dough. If you like this video, please subscribe for more videos on my channel. I post a new video every Friday. If you have any questions or requests for upcoming videos, please comment them down below. Also, feel free to comment down below what you thought of that edible cookie dough if you made it and have tried it. Thank you for watching. Bye.